What's up everyone? So last night I made myself a rough pour painting and I loved it. So I said screw it, let's try another one before my older sister. So I grabbed all my supplies and I went into my basement. And of course I grabbed Cheez-Its because I love Cheez-Its so much. I put my Dawn dish soap with water and I mixed that. Then I put all of my paints into these cups. After that, I put these two cups in the box I was going to pour in, and then also put my canvas on top of those cups. I then mixed the mixture into the paints, and put all of those paints into this same cup, and that is me doing it. This is what the cup looked like. Then I put the cup upside down, and then flipped that, and waited 30 seconds, and then lifted it. And this is what it turned out like, and I love it. Bye! We head for the sky, it's all right. Our wings wouldn't fly, it's all right. If we are crashing down again. 
So I'm just dotting away, being really happy with the progress on this, loving the rainbow color, working to finish up this green line. When I go and I make a dot, and I make a mistake. So I grab my trusty silicone brush, I pull off the paint, and then I paint over with black paint, and then I move on. What I usually do is skip a couple of spots, let the paint dry, and I was doing that, but then I made another mistake. Right there. Just a little tiny one. It was just a little edge that got kind of pushed out on one of these. So I just had to take the uh, little kind of point off of there. So it wasn't a huge mistake, but still it was enough that I had to sit there for a second and wait for paint to dry. And I thought of you guys because you guys helped me blow it dry on your screens last time. Hope you like it. I like getting money, I got time to get it Talk it on me, so my car's a tenny Dancing with the devil, I don't bargain with it Bobbing in the dash and the stick is ready Like a night, the four or five from a wet side But I'm from the east side, this how we slide This how we ride, this how we ride Can I have a peppermint? You can have a peppermint <laughs> That's too hot for me what? Hey! Like See, the, the rain is nice, but I, I don't really like getting wet. I thought I'd add a layer of fat to my sculpture and I didn't realize the skinny people would be so pressed about it. I'm just trying to show that there can be multiple ways to exist as a human and be beautiful. This is what I'm about. You should check out my page before you come at me. I also am autistic and speak very literally. I'll check out this line from the hip to the knee that's so beautiful. I'm going to take her up a couple clothes sizes every day until skinny people stop caring. Oh, that cash. Anyone gonna give me that? actually really easy to make. So you're going to start out with a white square sheet of paper. I'm going to use this pink one just so it's easier to see. And we're going to fold that in half. And then we're going to fold that in half again. Then we're going to unfold it and fold this edge up to the center. Unfold. And next we're going to fold this edge to that crease that we just made. There's going to be these creases at the bottom here. What we're going to do is we're going to fold this edge to line up with that crease and it's going to create a straight line across. Open that up and repeat on the other side. So lining it up just with this crease here. We're going to unfold. We're going to turn that around and open this up. And you'll notice that there's kind of this square starting to form in the center. We still want to create that crease to finish the square. So we're going to fold this bottom edge up so that these lines meet at the corners of these folds here. You're going to open that up and we're almost done. We're going to fold in half. This triangle here we're going to fold in half just like this. Do that on the other side as well. You're going to open those up and then unfold. We're going to repeat on the other side. Fold in half, both sides. When you unfold, it'll look something like this. Then you can go ahead and draw your face. And from here we can start collapsing our ghost. So we're going to make sure that all of these lines surrounding that square in the middle are mountain folds. So we're going to run across those really quickly. going to kind of give it a little bit of a pinch, kind of create a cube of sorts. And to lock the cube in place, we actually just made some folds here. We're going to fold over those little tabs that we made earlier. You might have to press them down a little bit. And then we're going to take these corners here and kind of roll them with our fingers, kind of create the bottom of the ghost. And there you have it, your very own origami ghost! Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to share if you made it.
Close my head, I'm going to lose back Between the joys and bottle jars Just me and all the red lights Keep on driving and driving In the heat from my hot California I forgot how you look like in rain I swear I never thought it would matter If I'm gone, but We gon' get it, we gon' get it, we gon' get it, we gon' get it, we gon' get it